With the huge success of National Treasure and National Treasure 2 making over $347 and $457 million respectively, many have wondered if there were plans on a National Treasure 3. In a recent interview, director John Turtletop, who also directed the upcoming comedy Las Vegas, was asked when he could see a third installment of the franchise and he said the following. If you can write the script, we'll take it. It's so damn hard to write a great historical mystery based on fact. It's not for the lack of trying. We want to do the movie. Disney wants to do the movie. We're just having the darndest time writing it. I'll bet that within two years, we'll be shooting that movie. Erin, buy or sell that a National Treasure 3 could be shooting within the next two years. I'm going to go ahead and sell this, you guys, uh, mainly due to, I don't know, absolutely everything that Turtle Top said in that quote. I mean, <laughs> considering the fact that the first two installments were extremely successful, almost everyone involved wants there to be a threequel. Bruckheimer said it, Cage has said it, John Voight's even said it. Mm. However, they don't have a script. Mm. And the script is going to be problematic because they're already talking about how hard it is to get. But he also said, if you can write it, and I'm assuming that's kind of like a wide open invitation, so maybe we should <laughs> collaborate on this, Amy Rose, and just <laughs> pitch it to him. But yeah, I don't think it's going to happen in the next two years. But soon, I think it will happen. Amy Rose? Um, I definitely think it could happen if you just, so I will buy that it will, um, if you just look at the numbers alone, $457 million for the last installment is not a small chunk of change. And you know, I love me some Diane Kruger and Nicolas Cage, like, they're fun. I love this whole adventure, you know, kind of roam. Um, I did like the first film much more than the second, but that's generally the case. Few sequels can outperform the first. Um, but yeah, I do, I do appreciate out of that quote that it's hard to write a historical mystery based on fact because I think that's what makes it great and you know we've seen a lot of things shoot without fully being in production getting rewrites and you know retunes to the script later on so I, th I think that if the interest is there especially from the director that has helmed the first two as well as the actors then it could definitely happen and there's a lot of great material out there that could be turned into a film like this so I think the, the monetary numbers speak for themselves I do think we'll see a third film. Yeah, uh, I'm going to buy that we'll see it at least go into production in the next two years, notwithstanding all the very valid points that Aaron brought up about they are having trouble with the script and bringing this thing together. But once you get the right idea, you can pull this together pretty quickly. And I don't think we're going to see National Treasure 3 in theaters in the next two years, no. maybe three years, yeah. but I think it'll, it may be in production. And there's a couple of things to keep in mind here. The escalating and the rising profit margin. I mean, a lot of times what we'll see, you know, people ask, hey, do you think we'll see a part three of this? And we'll have to say no because the first part of that franchise made this much and then the second part made this much, that's the wrong trajectory. The National Treasure franchise was on the right trajectory. Yeah. It's 350 million to 450 million. I mean, that's the direction the studios like to see. Um, you know, Nicolas Cage is not starring in a lot of blockbusters these days, so I'm sure he'd be more than happy to make himself available. Uh, the director seems he's all on board yeah. for it. I think the studio likes the numbers that they're seeing. They just gotta get this script together. And I think as time rolls on, it's kind of like being single and going to the bar. The more drinks you have and the later it gets, everybody starts to look prettier. No. And I think as more time goes on with, with this franchise, I think, and they're, they're losing momentum because, I mean, right now everybody still wants to see National Treasure 3. I think the more every year that goes by, less and less are interested. So I think Warner Brothers is on a bit of a clock where that script that was okay suddenly becomes, that's a pretty good script. <laughs> Let's go with it, we'll, you know, but we'll see what happens. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to AMC Movie News on YouTube. It's free and a great way to stay updated with all the latest movie news and check out our daily show, AMC Movie Talk. Also, don't forget to check us out on Facebook and Twitter to stay in the loop for our special prizes, giveaways, and contests.